and the ETFs. If you realize people aren't going to have all the time to trade stocks, like you you said that you tried with Robinhood. Now, I mean, those are all the things that Kevin's doing. And we only have a few more minutes, but I got to uh, be remiss not to ask. You said you called Vlad during the, the Robinhood stuff that was going on. What kind of conversation was that? Why would you reach out? Any you know things to share about what you think and you know any takeaways from that call with Vlad, who is the CEO of Robinhood? Yeah, I, I, I wanted to give him support before he went in front of Congress and got grilled by those guys. Um, it's so unfair to take an entrepreneur that was so successful as he was. You know, the number one app on Apple during that period, uh, 20 million plus accounts. Um, you can have your issues around, you know, whether you approve of the way his platform works or day trading at all. But the truth is you can't short a stock on, on Vlad's platform. Robinhood doesn't let you short stocks. It's, it, it's, it's really about safety. And, he, and, and as I, he's an engineer, and I, I, I love to work with engineers. And I, I didn't know if he'd call me back or not, but, but he did. And we had this conversation. and had his marketing team. Um, and I was really impressed with that guy. I mean, he, he was really a pragmatic guy trying to make it safe for people uh, to learn how to invest, which is what I'm doing in financial literacy. So we're totally aligned. And I also learned many other CEOs had called him with words of encouragement before he went up to that that crazy show that was going on in Washington. And and, I, and I'm very supportive of what he does. And I, I, I shout out to anybody that asked me, that guy, is they should shut him down. No, they shouldn't. He's done something no one else has done. He's got 20 million people that probably have never learned how to buy and sell a stock or build a portfolio doing it on the platform, which I think should be applauded. And I'm, I'm a supporter. And so, you know, we can disagree whether day trading is investing or it isn't. But it, they're learning something. And I argue to everybody that day trades on any platform, including Robinhood, take 10% of your winnings and put them into a robo app like a Beanstalks and, and leave it alone. Just let it grow for your future. You no, know, that's exactly what I did. And I looked at it a year and a half later. I'm like, whoa, I had no idea. I was up like 31%. I'm like, this is like free found money. I left it in there and I'm not looking at it. And uh, and I agree with you. Vlad has opened up the markets to the average person that wouldn't look at it. And he was a forerunner there. Absolutely. 